Hi, so today we're going to be talking about a half somersault maneuver. This is a great alternative if you aren't able to perform the Apley's maneuver for your BPPV. BPPV is a form of vertigo that you might have. So this is the most common type. So today we're going to be showing you the easiest way to perform the half somersault maneuver. So I'm going to be going through a walkthrough with it, but I'm not going to be doing it on time. So don't follow my lead with the time that I'm doing. Make sure that you have a timer available for yourself. Now this maneuver is actually done quite quick. It isn't something that we would go through in a slow movement. You're actually going to be going through it in a quite a quick motion. So what we're going to do is you're going to start on your knees. First movement is going to be bringing the head into extension. So again, we're going to be going quick. And then we're going to be putting our hands onto the ground as we bring our head down as if we were going into a half somersault. So we're going to be bringing our head down, tucking your chin into your chest and bringing your head close to your knees. Then on the side that is affected, so I'm going to say this is my right side that has the vertigo. So as I'm in this position, I'm going to look at a 45 degree angle. I'm going to hold this again with your timer for 30 to 60 seconds. So you're going to hold, then what you're going to do after 30 to 60 seconds is you're going to come up into a neutral spine while keeping looking at 45 degrees. Try to get a neutral spine and again we're going to hold for 30 to 60 seconds. After a 30 to 60 second timer you're going to go right back into sitting up looking at a 45 degree angle. So that's how you perform the half somersault maneuver to help out if you are unable to do the Apley's maneuver. So say you're not able to lean back or that is uncomfortable or difficult to do. This is also something that's fantastic to get to do on your own at home. So good luck.